Hello, today I'll be showing you how to change your circular saw blade and replacing it with a new one. First, you must check that the power is disconnected from the saw. Once you've done that, you can proceed taking the saw blade out. First thing to do that, there is a black lever here. This stops the blade from moving, allowing you to loosen or tighten this allen key bolt. As you can see, I have loosened the bolt and, the so and after it's taken out, the saw blade will come right out as well. I will be pre I will replace it with a new circular saw blade. One thing to note is that with your circular saw blade, they come with little rings. These rings go in the center hole here, depending on what size nut your saw is. But for this saw, we won't need it. To replace your circular saw blade, grab your circular saw, and you must put the circle around this nut here. You will know if you need the ring or not once you put the put it in, and it doesn't. And if it wobbles, you need to put it in. If it does not, you can you don't need it. Next, this washer here, which came off the the nut, must be replaced back onto the circular saw. And then the nut must be tightened down back onto the saw itself. Just like that. To crank down on it, you must again press this black lever, black lever down, grab your allen key, and in a clockwise motion for this saw, tighten down that nut. Doesn't need to be superhuman tight, you won't be able to get it off of it. And that's how you change it. Now, one more thing to note is that when doing this, you must check the circular saw blade to see if it wobbles. In my case, it looks like it's wobbling a little bit, so I'll just quickly take take it off and readjust it. This may happen from time to time, and this may occur if the circular saw blade does not perfectly fit with the saw, meaning that you need to attach that ring to it. Also, it could mean that you have incorrectly placed the blade onto the saw, meaning that you could accidentally have it not clamped down properly and leaning to one side. Let's check again. Done. It is now properly in line and not wobbling. And that's how to change the circular saw blade.